It's a fact of life. Every hard drive dies eventually, and when it's near death, you'll see the signs. Strange noises, corrupted files, crashing during boot, and glacial transfer speeds all point to the inevitable end. Solid state drives, or SSDs, don't have moving parts, but their storage cells do degrade a little bit every time you write to them, meaning they too will eventually fail, although SSD reliability is much better than it used to be. Even if you're not hearing strange noises coming from it, it's important to check in on your hard drive's health every now and then to see how it's doing. First, check your hard drive's SMART status. SMART stands for Self-Monitoring Analysis and Reporting Technology. It's a feature that monitors different drive attributes in an attempt to detect a failing disk. That way, your computer will automatically notify you before data loss occurs, and the drive can be replaced while it still remains functional. To check your drive's health on Windows, you can manually check the SMART status of your drives from the command prompt. Just type CMD into the search bar and open the application. In the pop-up box, run the following, and if everything worked out, there should be words on the screen right now, and you should type them in. It will return PRED FAIL if your drive's death is imminent, or OK if it thinks the drive is doing fine. For a more detailed reading of your drives, the Crystal Disk Info for Windows, it's free, or Drive DX for Mac OS, which is $20 with a free trial. These will both offer a more detailed smart information than your computer provides on its own. However, drives with caution or pred fail readings won't necessarily fail tomorrow. They could chug along for a year or two, or be dead as a doornail in a week. But if you're getting warnings, it's time to back up your files before your drive kicks the bucket. Now, it's not time for a full backup, though. You don't want to stress the drive with too many reads, or it could fail while you're backing it up. Copy just the most important files to an external drive. Then, do a full drive clone with something like EaseUs To Do Backup Free on Windows or Carbon Copy Cloner on Mac. In the end, it's not a matter of if your drive will fail, but when. All hard drives fail eventually, and if you want to avoid losing your important files, you absolutely have to backup your computer regularly, including when the drive is healthy. I know, you've heard all this before, but are you actually doing it? The good news is you have options. From Backblaze to Mac's built-in time machine feature, cloud-based backup is worth it.